everyone and welcome back and first of all this is an ultra channel meant for adult collectors thank you bye but i just want to say thank you to mattel for sending me the fan club exclusive Gloria doll for free uh i this i will never not get emotional whenever this happens mm -hmm. it's always incredible so um they messaged me and they were like we want to send you something and i was like what's it gonna be <laughs> and they're like we're not gonna tell you <laughs> and then like the next day M monster high posted like the the sneak peeks at her and i was just like i think it's her <laughs> but i'm gonna keep my mouth shut and here she is she's here today i'm so excited so she goes on sale tomorrow um i don't really know the time like the website says nine but like the post um like the monster high post says like at 12 so i'm like what the hell i guess check at nine and at 12 i don't know <laughs> uh well i guess you don't have to check at 12 it goes up at nine yeah but um Anyways, I'm just so excited that she's here, and uh, as a huge Golia fan, I'm, yeah. Yeah. And we have OG over here. So this is a Generation 1 Golia, not the new face. Mm -hmm. And I can't wait. She's finally getting, oh wait, she does have a collector doll. She's up there. But like, she's finally getting to shine on her own, and mm -hmm. I'm so excited. A more glam one. Yeah. Golia gets like, shit on a lot. <laughs> For, no for like no reason i'm like leave my daughter alone so let's start oh let's look at her box first so here she is she does come with a stand um the brain fabric detail that they use is so amazing it's so cute i want like a shirt with that yeah it's like all over there uh -huh. it says zombies are monsters too i don't know why they have that Abby. but um it's a really simple and new kind of packaging for like monster high i don't recall ever seeing a, a box like this for monster high and it's really sleek and elegant it looks like a tombstone almost mm -hmm. these are like such cute like additions there's sir Huzzle up up there with gulia skelet and a heart and it says gulia oh, gulax gulia yelps and then i'm not a fan of this font it looks like papyrus like <laughs> Uh, zombies are monsters too. Just some of her like insignias and death fast is right there. And then here's the back of the box. It says Gulex Gulia Yelps. The smartest ghoul at Monster High is creeping the halls in a look that's sure to make the ghouls rest in pieces. <laughs> Gulia Yelps wears a Gulex three piece ensemble with glam details. A crop turtleneck with the zombie's signature brain print is layered with sheer puff sleeves and paired with a high gloss jumpsuit with a metallic zipper trim an exoskeleton corset brings all the drama while drippy satin ribbon cuffs complement the edgy look the outfit reaches new heights with thigh-high boots in the signature brain print with a scary cute skeleto heel that's hilarious so i love cute. that Dramatic makeup and ghoulish accessories, including glowworm earrings. I wonder if they actually... I don't think they will glow. Um, skeletal crown and a gravestone purse complete with complete the look and make Gulia a bona fide fashion icon. Yep. Yep. And that, icon. That's icon. like the back of the box. Yeah, yeah, so you can see, like, this is such a cool piece. Mm -hmm. I'm like, please, make it. And then here, it just says Monster High. So now, let's get her out of here. <laughs> Because, like, she is the fan club exclusive, and I'm pretty sure you can only get her if you're part of the fan club. It's only 10 bucks a year, so I was just like, duh. No brainer for me. I'm going to do it. No brainer. Um, I didn't even read, like, what the, the, the thing that was, like, announcing the ghoul club, the fan club thing. I just, like, did it. And then the people in the group chat were like, that ghoul, you better look good. And I was like, what the hell are you talking about? And then I went back and I actually read what it, like, all the stuff, and I was like, oh! Yay! <laughs> I was literally like, what the hell are they talking about? Uh -huh. Let's see. It's Saran, I think. Yeah? Yeah. Again, guys, I'm horrible at, like, that sort of thing. <laughs> like, unless something is, like, poly poly. Like, yeah, like Claudine G3. Yeah, that's a nightmare. So here she is. We're getting her out. I'm so excited. Um... I, like, don't want to hurt her in any shape, way, or form. So yeah. I'm sorry if I'm going a little slow. No, so many clasps. Why? <sighs> Are you guys planning on getting her? Do you like her? Do you love her? Why do you hate her if you hate her? I just want to know. Like, I think she's excellent. I think she's 50 bucks. Which is probably the cheapest 
um, like Mattel Creations Monster Hide all that they've done uh, thus far, if I can recall. It's like the other ones were like 75 ish. That's a huge stand clip. I'm very confused right now on why it's so enormous. <laughs> I'm glad that it's this material though, and not like this material because yeah. this will snap. Mm -hmm. Like build the stand. That's huge. I wonder if, oh, it's probably cause like she's got like the exoskeleton thing. Okay, let me, let me claw her out. <clears throat> let me do this off so I don't knock over the camera. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's around. Oh my goodness, she's so sick. I love her so much. This probably, besides Signature Gulia, is my favorite Gulia. She's amazing. Yeah, bitch, this is humongous. Yeah, that clip's huge for no reason. Like, just use the Ever After High clip. That's what that kind of looks like to me, anyway. Like the boy one. Oh, cool. Okay, 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 okay. Let me get her bag out. I hand those to Sony. Sorry, guys. Oh, cute. Oh. All right. Okay. Anyway, right. so let's get into it. Oh yeah, my thing included. My little PR package included this really cute picture of Gulia. I love when they send this sort of thing. Like it's gonna look cute like that. And then it just has some information right there. Okay, there yeah. March 24th, and then there's, like, stuff for the membership and stuff. I actually love the idea of that, because Barbie does it, and I was just like, I think it's cool that Monster High has, like, the popularity where it can do that now. Mm -hmm. Um, Just, like, some benefits. I don't know. I know people hate that shit, and I usually do, but I'll say I'll do anything for Monster High, so... <laughs> Sorry, let me fix her up. God, she's gorgeous. Yeah. Okay, let me try to fix her glasses a little well, let me just i hate when they do this thing um so here she is she's so so pretty i love her lip color she's got her signature uh glasses which i love and let's look at her makeup i love Gloria's face so yeah. much it's so like mean i love it mm -hmm. so that's her makeup it's super intense more makeup on dolls, please. please. And I love her eyebrows, like those thick brows. So these are her original brows. They're like really sharp and mean. Damn, I didn't notice that Gully has really full lips. Mm. She's so pretty. The crown. She's the zombie queen, Avi. It's so cool. Okay, let's. This, this stand is ridiculous. Yeah, I <laughs> that is ridiculous. I'm probably going to try to find a, a smaller clip because mm. that's crazy. <laughs> so here is the outfit. The rib cage is so, so cool. I love that. Like the, the, the spinal column. I'm not really a fan of like when they do this where it's like in the front. I just think it looks ugly. I'm like, why can't we just flip yeah. it? Why does it have to look like that? Like, I guess it's longer in the back, and just to, like, curve over the the bodysuit. But the bodysuit is actually really adorable. These boots, fabric boots from Monster High. Yeah. Very first, I'm pretty sure. Are they? Yeah. They are so super gorgeous. Yeah. I'm so glad that we finally saw fabric boots from them. We've been needing them. So here's the treads of her shoes. They've got, like, her little symbols and stuff. The heel is so... Like, their hands... Skelettos. Skelettos. The That's outfit so is cool. super cute. I love how, like, garish and avant-garde it is. Like, this is a separate piece that can come off, and she does have long sleeves under here. You can see the brain pattern right there. I'm obsessed with the brain pattern. I need, like, a phone with, like, an iPhone case with that. Yeah. Uh, Monster High loves to do this type of thing. <laughs> they just love doing these ribbon things on, like, their wrists, and I don't really get it, but thanks for the extra fabric. <laughs> <laughs> Not really, really sure. Mm -hmm. She's so pretty. Her hair is hella long. It's Saran, guys. Okay, I keep touching it, and I'm like, yeah, it doesn't feel like shit, so... <laughs> Definitely Saran. Mm -hmm. 
And her only accessory is this bag. It's a tombstone. It says VIP. That's so cute. Yeah. I feel like it should have been like VIM or something, like very important monster or something. Mm. And then this is the back. I think this is what like, they were like hiding from everyone. And it's just like, okay. Yeah. So it's, it's, they're like patches and Cute. it's the same stuff that's on her um, uh, her box. There's like her pet. Oh, slow mo! What? Slow mo! Oh, how cute. His skull up there. Yay! Bring back slow mo. <laughs> Bring back slow mo, please. Better. And then I kind of recognize this from like the, the two pack with Cleo, I think. That was like the symbol because they were in the home and that chemistry class thing. And here's the details of the purse. It's got bones all along it and like hands clawing out. There's a little skelet. It's on a chain and it does pop open. I just did it. Yeah, there's nothing inside, but it would be cute if there was. Like a picture of Slamo. That'd be adorable. Yeah. So that's her holding it. I'm so excited. Oh, that, those earrings. I think they're Beetlejuice's earrings. And I think Monica might have worn them already. Mm. But I'm not sure. I wish that they'd been the... Because Ghoulie has worn earrings that are rib cages before. And I would mm. love to see that sculpt again because it's so cool. Yeah. So here she is. What do you guys think about her? What do you think about her, Tony? What I do you think, think about her? I think she's my favorite Ghoulie, too. Yeah, like today. Signature right underneath. <laughs> yeah, I was like, signature Gloria is like a masterpiece yeah. of a doll, I think. She's as, I think of her as fondly as I think about Abby. Yeah, like I look at signature Gloria and I'm like, how? Yeah. Like I love obviously the main three ghouls, but like why did they go so hard on Gloria? Like yeah. she's got like all these pieces mm -hmm. and these amazing boots. A full and, conception. Yeah, corduroy oh. like material. She's amazing. Piano belt. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. I never understood the music stuff for her because I'm like, uh, okay. <laughs> um, but yeah, I adore her. And again, I want to say thank you to Mattel for sending her to free for me to me for free. Um, I was gonna buy her anyway. Like I was like, I got my membership. I saved my money. I was gonna, I was gonna grab her. Mm. Um, but now I don't know if I will. Um, I probably will. Um, <laughs> to keep one in the box because it kind of hurt opening her because she is, you know, the first member doll. You know. Yeah. So that's kind of cool. I wish I could have kept this one in the box, but I needed to open her immediately. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, this is the PR box that they sent. I just want to show it because it's really cute. The pure boxes are always amazing. So it says zombies are monsters too. And then it says fan club right there. And it opens like that. And it says fan club. Gulia yelps. And then Miss Deadfast right here. I love that. Um, I'm not trying to knock over you, bitch. <laughs> so Miss Deadfast right there. So I cool. detest the smell of these boxes whenever um, I get them. Yeah. It's just such a pungent smell. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's like the the little like tinsely shit in there but yeah that's it for Gulia. let me know all your thoughts and opinions on her i actually really want to know she's so pretty just the eye screening is so so perfect i really hope since like she is being made in like smaller quantities i mean like a lot of the mattel creations are yeah. but because she's like the member doll i hope that like they're all perfect i really hope everyone yeah. gets a perfect doll like Please, Mattel, please. I hope quality control was up for this one because she's up wow. there. I'm I'm gonna put her with uh Hong Couture because I feel like she kinda yeah. goes with them. Mm -hmm. So yeah. Oh, that stuff's gonna look so sick. Yeah. So let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comments and uh I'll see you in the next one, guys. Bye. Bye.